Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to make an animated social media banner using Canva. The first thing I'd like you to do is to launch a Canva web application, which I've got something right here. The next thing is I'm going to walk you through the process of creating a Canva design. The two ways to go about that. First, to create a design from scratch. And how do you do that? Click on this create a design button right here to design from scratch. Or you can choose the option of starting your design using diverse templates. Head over to the search bar and describe your design. Once you've described your design, it's going to take you to a world of templates that you can choose from. Now, this template is ready to use, ready actually to inspire your creative processes. So for the sake of this tutorial, all we need to type right here is animated. social media banner and tada this is a word of templates okay i would like you to know that not all of the templates are easy to access or they're free to access as you can see some of them are labeled paid and they have this crumple thing meaning you have to upgrade your plan to access them but some of them are pretty cool and free okay so social media banner okay and um, I'm looking for something that is free and sweet. Mm. It has to be animated. Okay. Okay, this is cool. So I'm going to click on that and let's see how we can customize this. So click on customize this template. Too many tabs. Just too many tabs. All right. Got it. Okay, so here is something really nice. I'm just going to show you how to, of course, tweak this element to something that's actually going to catch your fancy. Okay, so here are elements. Um, in Canva, you need to see the elements that are actually clickable. You need to identify the, the elements that can be clickable or that can be tweaked. All right, how do you do that? Just move your cursor and then you're going to see that some of these things are segmented. Like this is an element that can be changed. Okay? These two is an element that can be changed. This is another one, the headphone itself. This is another one. This is another one. The star also can be changed. This can be changed and this can be changed. All right, so how do you change the word in? So here are the word in, double click and Let's say Amos Willis. If you want that to be, so I'm going to click on that and click on enter. So it's just going to be like Amos Willis. All right. So I'm doing a banner. I'm not selling something. I don't want to sell something. So I can just go ahead and click on that and delete. Click on this and delete. Click on this and delete. So that's all sweet. So what is the sweeties? Head over to elements, click on elements, and let me find my sweeties. I usually love books. Don't mind me. I just like books. So let me find the book elements that can be replaced with this. Mm. So I'm going to click on see all and find something that works so this is one and this is free drink and drop has been misbehaving lately all right so this is going to be deleted and this is going to fill my screen so just letting people know that hey lord this lady love books. 
So I'm just clicking on the edges, right? One hand in my mouse pad, one hand in the left corner. All right, so, and then you drag and drop, pull the edges and drag and drop. So double click that and set group key. <laughs> Can you centralize this? It doesn't look centralized to me, so that's centralized now. So all of this, I'm going to change the color, right? Click on my elements and head over here to color. And I'm going to change it to color. That is in my book. Sorry. This guy is hanging. Well, let's leave it. This will be fine. So in changing this to click on these elements and so I'm going to change the background color so click on that the background so once you're done changing anything it's important you click out so you can click so I'm changing the background and opening this up and oh that was that was really effortless mm, nah, 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 nah. this strikes me as better colors of these books are not giving me what I want so I can just change the color all right mm -hmm. and the red click on the red here mm. no 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 I think click on the blue and what else is gonna go Okay, that's that's fine. Oh, just for aesthetics purposes, this can be blue, and the blue can be this. Oh no, this the ash should carry the never be you. No, never go in. The navy blue should be okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know why it's pieces in, but I don't know what stops me from making that book white. <laughs> okay, so what makes it really beautiful? This bookie here also has to be changed. So just click on that and click on this text color and now I get the feel that this is not centralized so I just click on the border and drag and drop this drag and drop this too so I can even move it to this end. I mean, who told me that it has to be where it was? So click out and I'm going to centralize this. And this looks big, so I'm just going to have to reduce the size of it. And as you can see, that's already working out fine, smooth. So I'm just dragging and dropping. Okay. So here are the stars. I like them. All this X thingy. I like them. They should stay. And this one too. I don't know. Maybe I should just move it backwards a bit. Or... I don't know why I can place that thing. Let me see if that's helped. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. That's 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 very fine. All right. So I can now remove the star because space is key. So I can. Mm. This sweet breeze. <laughs> so
So now that I have changed this, I've shown you how to change this. You can now, I can play this and oh goodness, gives me good bumps already. I can click on page two and page two now can, of course, you can choose to tweak this just as you have been taught. All right, so. So just tweak it as you have been taught and that will be all. So you can go over this tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you're good to go. After you're done, click on share and head over to download. Choose a download settings to download what you have done. You can go over this tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you'll be good to go. I hope this video helps your search.